Hey guys, so this is what is in my children's Easter baskets this year. If you want to see what I have put in my children's Easter baskets, then keep watching this video. done Easter baskets in New Zealand. Easter generally is more about the chocolate for the kids um, other than doing actual baskets with all different kind of goodies in it. But I saw on Pinterest and um, other YouTube mummies doing these and I thought it was such a good idea, especially both of our kids have um, their birthdays at the end of the year with Christmas and so the rest of the year they don't really have a time where they get kind of a bunch of goodies. So I thought it was a perfect idea. So first of all I have got these baskets and these baskets I got just from the warehouse and they were five dollars each. I couldn't really find the carry baskets but I thought these were a good idea because we can keep these. They can use these afterwards for different things. They're quite big so I got this brown one. Sorry you just saw my messy bed and this white one. I'm not sure who's going to get what colour yet. Then I just got them some bunny ears each. I think they were $4. These were from the warehouse as well. Um, a lot of Easter stuff is quite girly, so it's very hard to find boys. Like You couldn't find any blue ones or anything, so that's the best I could do with those. But I thought those were quite cute. Um, then I have got them these little packs these were i think only two dollars each from kmart this one is Jaden's one and it's just you get to build that shot on the back yeah it's just doing different easter eggs making some bunnies and it comes with all the little bits and pieces and then i thought this one is cute for bentley because it's just got the crayons and coloring in books so it's a bit more for his age and like i said they were only like two dollars each I got their grass, they only had yellow, pink or white, so I couldn't get any green, but that's alright. They were only, their front came up for like a dollar each, I think. And of course we will watch Bentley with his and make sure he doesn't eat it or anything. He's kind of at the age where I think he's pretty clued up. It's not for eating, but of course we'll be watching him. For their um, kind of chocolate, now... Both of their sets of grandparents are going to be spoiling them and have already got them heaps of chocolate. So we didn't want to go overboard. And so we just got them both a little Easter egg each. Jaden's is a superhero one. And Bentley's is a Peppa Pig one. Because he loves Peppa Pig. And they're just little Easter eggs. And then we also got them these cute little oh, animal figurines and they've just got little chocolate animals and tractors and I just thought they were really cute and I think these were two for four dollars and these are two for four dollars so it didn't really work out very expensive until what we decided to do next so like I said the children don't really have any other time of the year um in the first like eight months or so of the year where they really get expensive stuff or what they really want like what they see on tv and all that kind of thing so we also decided to get them both something that they will really like. So first for Jaden, this was $34.90. This was from the warehouse. He loves Minecraft and um, he loves playing PlayStation, but we have limited him now. And a lot of his games end up just breaking or getting scratched and we don't buy him anymore because we thought he spends too much time on the internet. Or on the um, PlayStation and the internet as well. Sorry, there's my lens. But we thought that we would buy him this. He loves Minecraft. I don't get it. <laughs> but at school, it's the big thing. And so I thought he would just... He's going to go nuts. He is going to love receiving this. And so we thought, well, if we get that, obviously we have to get Jack Bentley something um, similar price and that kind of thing. But... Well, he's got so many DVDs, obviously he doesn't need games or anything, and his 
big like at the moment what he really loves doing is these things and this came in a box um, but I've taken it out of the box he loves pushing these around at the moment and he's only got little ones he hasn't got really any big ones and I've noticed he's outside in the dirt playing with them and so I thought I would get him a big one this actually was only $20 from Kmart but it's just so sturdy and the bucket comes out and I think he is just going to adore having that he is going to think that is so cool so I am going to go ahead and pack it all up I could not find bags I couldn't find the cellophane bags that people use to wrap this all up but we'll just place it all in and then just give it to the kids kind of just in the baskets as is so let's do it These are our Easter baskets. This is Bentley's one. I've had to put the egg in there because that bulldozer is just taking over. This is Jaden's one. Hopefully he doesn't spit the dummy about Bentley having a big toy in there before he sees this. So that is our Easter baskets this year. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and seen what we are giving our kids. I hope you guys all have a great and safe Easter. Be careful on the roads if you're traveling. Have a good long weekend and I'll see you guys in our next video. Bye.